Today's rant is brought to you by New Works Plumbing of Sacramento. Locally owned for over 20 years, New Works has a fix for you. For your plumbing needs and repairs, just go to newworksplumbing.com, N-E-W-W-R-X plumbing.com. Be sure and check out my podcast today. If you don't like that, I have my NFC preview coming up next week on Tuesday. I'll preview the AFC. And we wrap up the week later this afternoon, 3 o'clock Pacific, live on Listen App. Told you this before the NBA draft. I was leery about drafting Chet Holmgren because of his body type. You know, very tall and lean, lanky. Plus, you know, they're going to try to put on 30, 40, 50 pounds throughout his NBA career. And here we are. He's already done for his rookie campaign, injuring his foot at a pro-am in Seattle, defending LeBron James on a fast break. Now, I'm not as bothered by the fact that he was playing in a pro-am. I mean, there were a lot of high-caliber NBA players. Uh, uh, again, LeBron James was playing for crying out loud. Here's what bothers me. The fact that the players were playing on a court that was not safe. They actually stopped the game in the second quarter because of moisture and condensation on the floor. You can't have that. You cannot have a slippery floor. You can't have your NBA players playing on a court like that. I mean, you just can't do it. And now you have Holmgren, who's got a serious foot injury, who is out for the year. And I don't know about you, but when I look at his body, the one thing I was worried about were foot, ankle, and knee injuries. Again, I'm not a doctor. I'm not an expert in anatomy, but I have eyes. And it just did not feel right. I mean, I look at Zion Williamson and the weight on his body, and look, he can't even stay on the floor. He can't even get on the floor. Now you have Holmgren in his rookie year out already. Boy, you got to be really concerned. Can you imagine that phone call to the front office of the Oklahoma City Thunder? Wow. And then the results of the MRI, and you're out already for your rookie year. And you know what? Another shame is this kid looked really, really good in summer league. I mean, he has skills. There is no doubt about that. Zion Williamson has skills too. But skills don't really mean a lot in sports if you can't get on the playing surface. And we won't see Holmgren on the playing surface for at least 12 months. And that is a shame. And that's my rant for today. If you like what I had to say, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. I'll get back to you. And as always, I really appreciate your support. Have a great weekend. And again, thank you so much for checking me out right here on YouTube.